Hey guys, welcome back to Jeep 877 Adventures here. Today we got the Honkai um, 6.5 um, horsepower engine. And today I'm going to go ahead and try to get this thing test ready. And I'm going to hook it up to this bin that I got over here. As I got a new John boat over there. And right over here is the bin here. I'm going to fill this up with some water, attach the motor to it. And uh, we're going to see what happens. Alright guys, so I got this mount in my bin yet. I haven't put the water in yet though, but I've just located where the oil goes. Looks like it goes right here. It comes with this little funnel and the um, oil that I'm going to be using for it is what they recommend. It's the 10W30 um, for four stroke, the marine grade uh, for marine motors. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in there and then um, while I'm, and I'll hook up the fuel line to it and get that going. And for that I'm using Supreme Gas is what they recommend, Supreme or Ethanol Free, whatever you can get your hands on. Um, be easier to get the to get supreme, so that's what we're gonna put in there. And I'm gonna try to see if I can attempt to get this thing fired up. Hey guys, I'm back now. Um, it did take a couple of good five good squirts of uh, of put pulling the um, this right here. I had to give it about a good five primes, and then a couple pulls, and she fired her up. I got the lid on here. Uh, right now it's on idle and the neutral. I had to turn it down a little bit lower than what they had. Um, everything seems to be good with it, although it did have one small damage. I'm actually um, in contact right now with the seller. I'm going to see if they give me a replacement or what I can do about getting a replacement. It says something minor, but I would like to have everything 100% since it is a brand new motor. And you can see it right here. The, um, the cover has a small crack right there. Um, I mean, I guess it's nothing really that major, but it could become an issue later on down the road. Now I just had to get that squared away, um, if I could. But I'm not, I'm going to let it here, stay here in idle for about an hour or so. Yeah. I'll, I'll show you guys again once I get put in the first gear um, forward and we'll see how it looks there. Um, but right now according to the instructions it says about leave up for like an hour or so on idle here just to really give it a good break in. So we'll be right back. So I've been letting my uh, Hankai 6.5 horsepower um, outboard here run for about an hour or so and I just went ahead, uh, rule of advice, turn the throttle down to where it almost sounds like it's going to kill out then switch into front wheel drive and then kind of slowly increase a little bit that way it's not too much uh, movement onto it. Uh, the first time I did it, it was, uh, I kind of did it quick and it all made like a thunk. <laughs> so don't do that. But this one looks like on pretty much a low speed. That's probably like an idle. And the uh, front wheel motion where you pull it towards you, forward. But yeah, it seems to be doing pretty good, and that's the Honkai motor. I went ahead and uh, took out the box, unboxed it, set it all up, and um, got it going. So the next video that you'll be seeing will be me out in the water. So until next time, see ya.